also do um, a bag of ice. Okay. Hi, Pepper Lou. Hold on. All right, pup, let's get to camp. Let's get to camp. Let's take care of that. Wow, this is super hard to do one-handed. they were all over 30 so I don't really know why my tire light was on but whatever do you guys like my outfit today hashtag fashion you know what I'm saying yeah I have taken off these leggings for the past three days every day when I go to change and I just put them back on after I change my shirt and my socks and underwear so I really am the vision I really am a fashion icon Two different kinds of camo. I don't even really like camo, so I don't know why I'm double wearing it today, but you know, whatever. Uh, it's supposed to thunderstorm all afternoon, so that's fun. I'm gonna wrap this up and then we're gonna go take Blue on a walk, cause he, yeah, you're gonna need some exercise, bud, if you're gonna be in the car for three hours while it thunderstorms. And then there's a break later this evening, so we'll walk him again then, but. We're on blue duty right now, as we always are. You know what I mean? Go for a walk? All right, come on. I can already hear the thunder starting, so I don't know how long we're going to be able to walk for, but we'll 
We'll give it our best. Blue. The clouds are looking real rainy. I think right now we're like 25 minutes from where I parked through, so let's hope this rain doesn't start right now. All right, Blue Drop. Good boy. Way. Man, those clouds look moody. We lucked out and didn't get any rain. It's like just now starting to sprinkle, so just in time. Ready to get in Rue Blue? <laughs> Rue Blue. Wow, that's really pretty though. All right, bub, drink your water. Let's hop in the car. I'm seeing lightning too, so we really do need to get inside the car here. Did you guys know that one of the safest places you can be when there's lightning is inside of a car because of the rubber tires? Fun facts. Drink of water. Come on. Drink of water. Good boy. Good boy. Do you want to go lay on your cooling pad? Yeah. Bubby, why don't you, uh... Here, go back. Get on your cooling pad. Go get back. Get on your cooling mat. I'll turn on the AC for ya. I think it's only supposed to rain really bad for like two hours, so I'm gonna um I'm gonna get some planning done and like organizational logistic stuff for the week done. I'm trying to optimize my time here and then as soon as the lightning and stuff is done we'll get out and let blue play again. Yeah, huh? Yeah. Just take a little nap. We'll be right back to it before you know it. Okay, so I just had a video post, so I've been responding to comments. And, <laughs> sorry, Blue, am I messing up your nap time? If anybody out there travels with hotspots, please comment below which you believe is the best. Because if I'm going to get a hotspot for Rue, I need a good one. Thanks. But I'm starving, so I think I'm going to grab something from the back. And I'm going to show you guys how I do this. <laughs> It's honestly pretty entertaining because Rue's tiny and watching me navigate that I'm sure is funny. But I do this all the time. So let me take you guys back and show you how I get food when I don't want to deal with the weather. I don't want to. Yeah, you just keep sleeping, bub. You just. I'll be right back. Oh. <laughs> well, you can come back with me, Blue, but that's not necessarily going to make this any easier on me. Do you guys think that maybe we've outgrown Rue just like a tad, or do you think we're, we're good here? All right, so the trickiest part of doing this, right, is because right now, I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't, should I turn this on? Cute, okay, that's better. I don't really have a ton of food with me right now. I have more of like snack stuff. So I'm gonna grab a yogurt. But I have granola in in my cooking tote that's underneath my platform. So I'm going to show you guys how I navigate this. Because it's actually kind of funny. Like crawling back here to get into my cooler is not really a big deal. This is kind of fun. I've never like taken you guys along with me when I've been like stuck in the car for a lot of the day in the rain. So you guys, this is the real deal of what happens. We get work done. And I crawl all over the inside of Root while Blue naps on and off and dreams about tennis Smart. I want granola for this yogurt. I have to open 
blindly because I don't, I can't see. I open the cooking toe like two inches. And it helps more now that I've like organized it. And I feel, or I can literally feel this granola right now. Blindly feel around until I get what I need. Ow. Not saying it's the most graceful, but whatever, it works. Here we go. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. I need to get a spoon from my side compartment here. Ah! Yogurt on the loose. The rain's really starting to pick up now. Oh, hi, Bubby. What's it doing? You guys know what I did order for Blue, though, that I'm actually really excited about? I ordered him a doggy raincoat because we've just been dealing with so much rain lately and I like don't want him to have to get all nasty but just because it's like kind of sucks to have to take care of his coat when he's all muddy and stuff and I don't want him to like feel gross all the time. The reason I, I don't go out in the rain like this is because of blue. I don't want him to get drenched. I partially don't want to have to sleep with a wet dog, you know what I mean, like that smell all night but also I just don't want blue to feel like crap because again blue comes first before everything. I can imagine being a dog and having like a wet coat and going to bed wouldn't feel too great. So anyways, long story short, I ordered him, ordered him a raincoat so we can go play in the rain so we don't necessarily have to be stuck in rue on days when it storms. You know what I mean? You want to like this? Look. Heck yeah, dude. Thanks, bub. You guys know when I first decided to get a dog, <laughs> like the main argument I had to myself to get one like the main reasoning was when I drop food on the floor or if I need something cleaned up it's so easy for a dog to just pick it up off the floor or clean, like clean the top to my yogurt container I'm not joking that was my argument to everyone of why I was getting a dog and lucky for me you were the best thing to ever happen to me I don't know if you can, can you have granola probably right I don't know. This is coconut almond. Yum! Has high protein too, heck yeah. This dog, uh, self cooling mat too that I got him for the summer actually really works. Like my butt right now is cold. I'm sitting on top of it. It's chilly, so if anybody has a dog that does not do well in heat, especially if you have like a double layer or a double coated dog, like Aussies or, you know, Huskies or, you know, dogs that have double, is it a double layer, co double coats, like an undercoat, you know what I mean? This is perfect. Yeah, you love this thing, don't you? You're like chilling like a villain, bub. I think this is gonna be my dinner tonight. I honestly don't have anything to make. Whenever the rain stops, so I might get out and make coffee. There's honestly something about editing a video in the middle of the night with like hot coffee at midnight that just really excites me. And you're probably like, Maria, how do you drink coffee and immediately go to bed? I'm just God's favorite. Well, wow, you can't see the mountains at all. At all, anywhere. Okay, so that's what rain does, you guys. You guys, on my research today, you know what I found? A rooftop shower that you can put on the side of your roof rack that has like 10 gallons in it. You can literally shower from outside your car. I might have to get one. That sounds pretty enticing. Usually I do the whole Planet Fitness thing, but I've been in the Colorado mountains for the last couple months and there's no Planet Fitness here. Like when I go to the when I go to shower here, I have to pay like $20 to drop into a random gym that I'm not a member at. And I was just thinking the more I'm trying to like go off grid and stuff 
it might make sense to bring a shower with me. I know they have like those sun bags you can like hang from trees and stuff, but that's not really my vibe. And my hair is so thick and long that it takes me 17 business days to actually like wash shampoo out of it. So having like a 10 gallon shower on the side of my roof rack might be worth it. Might be worth it. Anyways, that's what my research showed me today and I'm, I'm, I'm into it. You want the rest of this? <gasps> There's a fly in here. Uh, this is a no bugs allowed zone. Okay. At least it's only a little gnat, so I don't have to like totally freak out, but. Get out of here. You're not welcome. All right, let's go to the front. Oh my gosh. Okay. One hour left of rain, bub, and then we can go. You know what? Oh. Oh, of course. Nice to meet you. Fancy meeting you here, sir. Do you come here often or? I just feel like I'm in the Pacific Northwest. It's so pretty. These skies right now are insane. 